On 26th November 2016, Major Muhammad Chigundu, a former commander of the Allied Democratic Front rebels, was shot and killed together with his driver who doubled as a bodyguard. Several suspects were rounded up by police from different parts of the country and charged with Chigundu's murder. The suspects were all Muslims. In August 2017, the date for the trial of the suspects in the International Crimes Division of the High Court was set. They were later produced in court and charged with murder. Later, other charges were leveled against them. These included aiding and abetting terrorists, belonging or professing to belong to a terrorist organization, and rendering support to a terrorist organization. Today, the 11 suspects who have been on remand for nearly four years were brought to court to formalize their acquittal after the Director of Public Prosecution dropped charges against them. Some of the suspects were limping. They include Abdulaziz Abdushakul, Sulaiman Wayaba, Bashil Nyangiso, Majid Sulait Lukwago, Abbas Fikil Yusuf Al Qaeda, Abbak Al Katende, Lukia Namlondo, Malik Senabulia, Yasin Galiwango, Sula Usama Mugozi, and Asuman Musijo. The 11 appeared before court registrar Stella Atingo, who formalized the acquittal as per the decision of the Directorate of Public Prosecution. And the accused persons have been produced today for formal release from court. Already the court has endorsed the discharge orders and the release orders. So you're going to get copies and unless, unless you are held on other charges, from here you are a free person. The former suspects and their lawyer had this to say. Some of our friends who have been on remand for eight years are still inside. We want them released. I am not happy with the DPP. How could they remand us for all this time without evidence? These kinds of actions should end. One, in the year 2017 and 2018, most of them were tortured. And one of the remedy we are going to do this time round is to file an application for torture or infringement of their rights. But if you realize, so far you have seen one today who is limping, but there are many with different wounds. There are many with different marks, which we need again to help them to take them to hospitals. Or the suspects were arrested for killing the former AIGP Felix Kawesi, and later they were linked to the murder of Major Muhammad Chigundu, and later on linked to being members of ADF. And for almost four years, these people have been coming to court back and forth. And what kind of evidence did prosecution present before this very court to sustain the case for all this time? Now, the state had deceived the public together with us, the lawyers and court, that they had evidence. It is until the third and fourth time when we appeared before his lordship that they accepted that they don't have evidence. The suspects' relatives shared their joy and what they want to be done. I am happy that my son Abdul Aziz has been released. I am happy that my brother is out of jail. I am happy to be reunited with my children. The government should allow prisoners on remand to receive visitors. One of the suspects, Abakal Katende, was sent back on remand to Luzira prisons, pending further trial and investigations. Sudir Yarhanga, NTV.